tell me that you love me even if it's fake cuz i don't fucking care Hey what is up you guys, this is Nacho here and welcome back to another Call of Duty Infinite Warfare video. In today's video we're going to be taking a look at the epic drone package, the drone package vault. You guys have been asking for this one for quite some time so I figured I'd finally do it and let you guys know whether this is actually worth it or not. So this care package costs a whopping 1200 score, yes you guys heard that right, 1200 score. Pretty expensive for a care package, I think basically it costs double if not almost three times as much as a regular care package now is it worth it so this care package the ability it gives you is that it gives you the chance to earn higher tier streaks or you basically only earn higher tier streaks and mid tier streaks with those considered being bad so is this worth it man in all honesty, I called in probably around 15 to 20 of these and I would say at least like 80% of them were a Warden or better. A lot of them were Apexes and Thors, I got a couple RC8s and the lowest streak I ever got from using this is a Sentry Gun. So like the thing with this is that I feel like the chances are completely random. I try to call in a lot of them to see if I would ever get stuck with like a shitty streak meaning like a UAV or a Scarab or something for 1200 points just because of the point calculation. and. Out of like the 20 I called in, like I said, I didn't even get one of those. The lowest I got was a Shock Sentry, uh, so I guess that's pretty good. I'm assuming the lowest streak you can get out of this will probably be like a Trinity Rocket, Bombardment, and Shock Sentry, and above. Because there is a point, which I'll show right now in the gameplay video, is where I call in two of these care packages at the exact same time, and I end up getting advanced UAVs in both of them. So that's a really, really great like score right there. It's a good score streak. You get advanced UAV for 1200. It's pretty much an how much an advanced UAV costs, so that's worth it. But in this other clip, you guys will see that I call in another two of these back to back and I get double shock sentries. Now, you wouldn't want to have shock sentries uh, for 1200 score, but you can get it for much, much less. So, in that regard, it can be kind of shitty. The only thing that would suck about using this in a multiplayer environment is calling it in and getting a shock sentry or getting like a bombardment or something you don't want and you just basically wasted the score streak you know you got to play for it uh, and you got to you got to take the chances and honestly it can be rewarding at times because on maps it can give you like a RC8 or it can give you an apex or something like that but for me I like consistency I don't really like leaving it up to chance you guys can decide whether it's worth it to you in your opinion but in all honesty guys in my personal opinion no you're better off just running the high tier score streaks because why leave it to the roll of the dice uh, you're better off just keeping control of your own little destiny if you guys know what I mean uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video I'm not saying this care package is bad it's still really fun to use and it's overall really great but I just don't like the fact that you can't control what streak you get out of it because let's say you're playing on a map that's all indoors and you get like a Thor or you're playing on a map that's like three stories high and you get like an RC8 so you can't even top up onto the stories you know I just don't want to be stuck with something that I wouldn't want but let me know if you guys have had success running this drone package or if you guys have been wanting it for quite some time but hope you guys i hope i answered you guys questions as always on this papa nacho let me know what score streak variants you guys like to see in the next video maybe i'll pick yours thank you guys for watching subscribe to join nacho nation and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out nacho nation <laughs>